Hi friends, I am Arun Giri. You are most welcome to our channel Technical Concept. So our today's topic is dry bulb temperature and wet bulb temperature. So in this video, I will explain you what is dry bulb temperature and what is wet bulb temperature and how we can calculate dry bulb temperature and how, how to measure this wet bulb temperature. And also what is the application of these two temperatures. Okay. So let's start our video without wasting the time. So first of all, we will see what is dry bulb temperature. So dry bulb temperature is a very simple uh, concept. So, suppose this is a thermometer, simple th normal thermometer. By using this thermometer, we are measuring the temperature of any area or surrounding. By protecting this bulb of this thermometer from moisture and radiation. Then this therm temperature is known as dry bulb temperature. Suppose this is a room. This room does not contain any moisture uh, or radiation, di uh, sunlight radiations. Okay. So if we are measuring the temperature of this room by using this thermometer, normal thermometer, then we will call this temperature as a dry bulb temperature. Okay. So it is very simple to measure the dry bulb temperature. Now we will see what is wet bulb temperature. So wet bulb temperature is also a very simple concept. Suppose we are wrapped the bulb of this thermometer by a wet cloth and then we are measuring the temperature of the area or surrounding. Then we will call that temperature as a wet bulb temperature. Suppose we are measuring the uh, temperature of this room by using uh, this thermometer but this thermometer uh, bulb is wrapped with a wet cloth or wet cotton. Okay. So, this wet bulb temperature is always less than the dry bulb temperature okay and this difference is called as a depression suppose we are measuring the temp dry bulb temperature of this room and its temperature dry bulb temperature is 32 degrees celsius and by using uh, this same thermometer if you are measuring the wet bulb temperature by using this wet cloth wrapping uh, wrapped on the bulb in such condition our temperature will be less than the dry bulb temperature and this difference is called as depression okay so this depression depends on the humidity of the area if this uh, if the humidity of the area is more then this temperature difference is very less okay and if humidity of the area is less then this temperature difference is more okay that means uh, wet bulb temperature of the area depends on the humidity of the area okay how this wave temperature uh, measured okay so this wave temp uh, working of this wet bulb temperature is very uh, interesting when we are wrapping the wet cloth on the bulb then what happens it, uh, air comes in contact with this wet cloth and when air comes in contact with this wet cloth then what happens evaporation of the water or moisture take place from the cloth okay then this, the, uh, due to this evaporation what happens cooling effect generate on the wet bulb okay and due to this cooling effect the temperature becomes lower than the dry bulb temperature okay so this is the phenomena difference between this uh, dry bulb temperature and wet bulb temperature and this wet bulb temperature is directly proportional to the humidity of this surrounding or humidity of the air Suppose the humidity of the air is more, then our wet bulb temperature will be more. Okay. Suppose our surrounding air has humidity of relative humidity of 100%. In such condition, the temperature difference between dry bulb temperature and wet bulb temperature is zero. That means this depression will be zero. When our surrounding air has 100% humidity, in such condition, dry bulb temperature is equal to wet bulb temperature. Because in such condition, there will be no evaporation of water from the wet cloth. Uh, and when there is no evaporation, there, there will be no cooling effect on the wet, uh, bulb of this thermometer. So, in such conditions, when our surrounding air has 100% relative humidity, in such conditions, the wet bulb temperature will become equal to dry bulb temperature and this depression will become zero. Okay. So, this is all about the today's video wet bulb temperature and dry bulb temperature so i hope you like this video if you like the video then please press like button subscribe the channel and share this video so thanks for watching bye bye